Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Spartan. And I'm Pudgy. And today we're watching Stranger Things Season 3, Episode 5. So we're coming off the back of a very hot episode. Yes. We were freaking hyped. Even our editor told us, God damn, you two were hyped. Yeah. Because the end of last episode where we had Elle and Billy duke it out. Yes. Was just Crazy. something else. I'm always impressed by this series' ability to evoke a lot of emotion from me. Because at a surface level, the premise, the setting, the child actors isn't the entire formula for a Spartan emotion. Yeah. And yet somehow this series never fails. I've, I've got a soft spot for Elle, you guys know, no doubt. And this series never fails to just have me teary-eyed. And I'm like, damn, man, it really, really hit. Do you kind of see Elle as your daughter in a way? People say that in the comments too, that my relationship with Elle kind of gives like, like the father-daughter vibes. I don't know. I think I am an older brother to sisters and I've always been very protective. And so that part of me definitely comes in mm -hmm. and maybe an element of that extrapolates to L. And so possibly I do have that connection, but for one reason or another, she, yeah, her innocence and mm. she's just very cute. And I, I feel protective over that. And when I yeah. see her truly like just giving it all, yeah, I don't know. My emotion just floods out. And Billy, that acting was something else. Like awesome. Wow. You really believe him, don't you? And we sympathize with him and we feel sorry for him now. So it makes it even more interesting because he's like a tough character who's in a lot of agony and pain. Yeah. And that vulnerability is always, it hits more when you see somebody who's traditionally very tough and doesn't show their vulnerability. Then for them to show it, you know, they're really hurting. I'm just really hoping that he doesn't die. I know. Because dude. if the, that's the only way to stop this, it's going to break my heart. Because let me tell you... At the start of season three, I, I kind of realized that it's all the B's that die. Every name that starts with B. And guess who we forgot? Benny. Yeah. Our boy Benny died. Uh, I read that comment too. So it literally, I don't know if they attended, but you're right. It's been all the B's. It, it's still crazy to me the coincidence that that happened. It's not a coincidence. I really hope they don't kill Billy, man. Like, so if we get a new character and it's like part of the main cast. And, and it's the B's B, we know it's gone. Unless... Now that we've caught on, and I'm assuming they would like the rest of you know the audience would have live. They might have like switched it off a little. Yeah, look, the rest of the court, the rest of the audience ain't Spartan and Pudgy TR. <laughs> they don't have that Spartan and Pudgy billions, you know. See how he's talking down on you guys, <laughs> dude. I did you up with me. How are you gonna sell out on me? Forget it. Just Spartan TR. <laughs> they don't know Pudgy TR here. Oh my god. <laughs> but if they do kill Billy. Or don't will depend on whether the curse is broken or not. So I hope they don't kill him, and I hope because I'm actually really liking this character. So am I. I honestly want to explore him without the mind flayer like taking over his body now. I know because he'll be changed. Maybe he'll be a bit more, just a bit more relaxed. I mean, more... we saw him. He was like very vulnerable. Yeah, he was like I didn't want to. Like he made me do it. Like he was yeah. very emotional. Broken. And you saw, yeah, and you saw that. I don't know, even in between, he there was something between him and Maxine. Like, you saw that he cared. So, yeah. Cared what she thought of him in mm. that moment. And we've also got Dustin, Steve, Robin, and Erica. Yep. Which you don't fail to remind me because I forget her. <laughs> they had discovered, well, they'd, they'd infiltrated whatever that substance was that the Russians were working with. Yeah, I think it is part of the Mind Flayer, essentially. Oh, not necessarily Mind Flayer because they're working with the Gateway, I think. Yeah. But yeah, the Mind Flayer's got his own agenda. I don't, I don't, he wouldn't be really... No, no, no. They're not working with, like, the... The, the Upside what Down? was in the green tube, oh, I, I feel like I think more Upside was. Down, not the Mind Flayer <laughs> in the particular. Okay. But again, maybe, I don't we'll know. We'll find out. Could be either Hopefully or. this episode. <laughs> Point is, Elevator's gone down and they're going down with it. And that's yeah. where we left off. Yeah. Oh, and we also saw... The army that Billy's built. That's where we left off. Yeah, there's an army now. That's uh, fucking wild. As the Mind Flayer had envisioned. And so it's like literally build. everyone in this little town. Like, not everyone, but like a lot of people, like your neighbor. So you really don't know. Yeah, this town has no chill. No. Nah. Thank you to everyone over on Patreon for supporting the channel. If you do want to get up to four weeks of early access to our reactions or watch them in their uncut form, we'll leave a link to our Patreon in the description. And if you guys are watching this over on YouTube, don't forget to leave a like on the video. 
Subscribe to the channel and let us know in the comments down below what you thought of this episode. All right, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Eric is like, what the hell did I sign up to? So much for being discreet. <laughs> oh my God, his voice is gone. <laughs> <laughs> Dustin cracks me up. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, cop some whiplash. Is everyone okay? Yeah, I'm great now that I know the Russians can't design elevators. <laughs> <laughs> They have to do something. Yeah, if we had a key card. What? It's an electronic lock. Oh, they don't have key card. They're screwed. She's very smart. If I'm not home for Uncle Jet's party tomorrow, and my mom finds out you three are responsible, she's gonna hunt you down one by one and slit your throat. I don't. I believe it with all that attitude. Uncle Jack's party. Oh and yeah. Find us if we're dead in a Russian elevator. Go, Steve. Tell her where it is. What if we climbed out? God damn, that's some climb. Not gonna lie, Steve spoke my my words, so I'm happy. What were you saying about climbing? How the hell are they meant to climb that? Oh, normally there's an escape ladder, but they ain't one in this one. They don't want anything escaping here. Looks like somebody's home. Oh, the. Van with the silver cap. Where's it coming from? Sounds like the gate almost, doesn't it? Yeah, all the magnetic it's field a little bit. She's next level. Oh, you're right. Yeah, that red flashing looks like the gate. Oh my god, so they've just bought this house to have access to it. Yeah, Joyce needs to become a detective, man. She's great. It would be a waste if she didn't. Oh my god, no! Why is he here now? I mean, I know why, but... The freaking now... timey, man, yeah. Or maybe it is the, the hey, magnet. Hawkins PD, hands in the air. Oh shit. We need you to block over Nidil. We need you to win the game. We need 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 to win the game. Oh, behind him. Oh, oh yeah. Shit. Drop a bitch. You don't put that thing away. I'm going to blow some daylight into that thick skull of yours. No. Oh, damn. Oh. He's been watching Hop. Because you're a policeman. Policemen have rules. Oh, yeah. Try me. It's all about the bluff now, baby. One, two, three. He did. He actually shot. Go oh, hard. Oh, shit. Yeah, after everything he's been through. Yeah, hop and playing. Man, you just better hope that you don't get shot. That man's lucky he reacted. Go hop, yes. Come on, hop, come on. He's so well trained. Oh, it's Billy versus Steve all over again. Oh, oh maybe yeah. not. Yeah, let's play dirty. <laughs> Joyce, what the fuck was that? Joyce, that was horrendous. Did nah, you play Joyce, sport? Joyce, that was shit, dude. What the hell was that? Oh shit! Joyce, Holy shit! Come on, Joyce, quit <laughs> These people can't throw <laughs> or catch. Yeah, terrible. Joyce, drive. I'm Joyce, trying. please, Joyce, drive. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, I know. So you always the same time as Bianco, I man. I know. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. God damn. Oh, thank goodness for that. Still think it was our government? <laughs> Definitely not. That was intense. I'm at the hospital with Driscoll. What? She's been sedated for a few hours. My doctors are still running tests. Nancy, please tell me you're joking. She ain't joking. I need you to put me on the phone with your brother. What? Jonathan. Oh, to test the symptoms. He's not even here. Where is he? Is he safe? Why wouldn't he be safe? Oh, now Jonathan's gonna take it seriously. Oh, shit. You see that PD's day kicking in? Those who are a little late to the party. Yeah, this time. The machines at Hess Farm where, where we can you. Boys, please. You give me a headache, both of you. <laughs> She's way too chirpy after what just happened. I know. Mirnov is Russian and works for Starcourt. Two uh, things we already knew. Thought we knew, but now we know no because I've confirmed them. You're welcome. Good job, Choice. Good job. Why don't you confirm whether this baby will start, huh? Keep it in park, please. Yeah, no. <laughs> do something useful. You do something useful. They're funny. They're already bickering like an old couple. It's not working. What did he just realize? He knows why it's not working. Hey, hey. What's he saying? Shit. Oh, Jesus. Oh, lucky. Oh, shit. Save their freaking life. Lucky she ran out. So we're walking to Illinois? Yeah, yeah, we're going to walk to Illinois, you know. I figure we'll get there by like Friday evening. I hope that works with the schedule. Jesus Christ, Joyce. We're not walking to Illinois, okay? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, they're having a little sassy bicker here. Just saying. What the hell's happened? What the fuck? What beam? Oh, okay. Far out, I was going to say. Oh, I was going to say, that was, like, creepy as. Something's not right. I can't get Hopper off my back all summer. Now, all of a sudden, he's hiking with Will's mom to Illinois, and Dustin's MIA, too? I mean, this can't be a coincidence. Obviously no, not. You're on something, my friend. It's up to us. Up to us to do what, exactly? Find Billy and stop him. Okay, yeah, that's a really nice sentiment, but even if Elle could find him again, and that's a pretty big if, then what? Yeah, it's not just Billy anymore. We got the mind flare out of Will before and he just came right back. We don't just have to stop Billy, mm, we have to stop the mind flare. How in the hell do we do that? I don't know. Yeah, it's a very different ball game. Not now, Mom! Mike, open the door. The gang's All right, back. Finally, <laughs> everyone's well not everyone, but some people are getting They're together. They're already back together when the world's gonna end. What are you doing? <laughs> what does it look like I'm doing? I'm taking a leak. Look away. Look away! <laughs> <laughs> These two. Can you redirect your stream, please? Is it coming in? Oh my god, that is so funny. It was like zigzaggy. Hey, hey, careful, careful, careful. What does she think she's doing? What the hell are you doing? We can survive down here a long time without food. But if the human body doesn't get water, it will die. That ain't water, my friend. But this is not water. No, but it's a liquid. And if it comes down to me drinking that shit or dying of thirst, I drink. I'd rather yeah, die of thirst. We've got company. Never a dull moment. Never. Is that their one? Yeah, it is. Come out, knock him out, and get back up. Oh, I can smell the piss! Oh, I think you can smell piss that quickly, man. Well, it's probably dehydrated, it probably stinks. They're all just above. 
Dude, I'll be scared. This elevator starts. You can get crushed. Okay, so she kept one vial. I mean, thank goodness for Erica, I guess. Oh, go Steve! Are you really going through with the mission? I thought they were going to try and get back up. Oh, shit. Oh, get out she of She was going to drink that. Hey, she wanted to drink that. You still want to drink that? <laughs> Holy mother of God. Well, what? you guys are in good shape. Oh my goodness. Look at you, roast beef. <laughs> roast beef. What time was this attack? Last night. Right, but what time last night? Uh, around nine. You waited all night to call. I was waiting for the doctors to run some tests. You weren't there? Well, I'm here now, aren't I? Oh God. <laughs> Travel in paradise. What time was your sauna test? Around nine. Around nine. Well, that proves it. That proves my theory. She's flayed, just like Billy. Flayed? The mind flayer. He flays people, takes over their mind. That's the term. They get flayed. Once they do that, they basically become him. If there are two flayed, we have to assume. Yeah. Heather. Yeah, now Heather it, as well. Yeah, now it makes sense. Heather Holloway? Tom. Yeah, the boss. That's how they figured it out. It's all making sense. They're this all cool. adding it up, yeah. I always love the part where the crew all gets together. Mm -hmm. I'm like, all right, now it's game on. Tell me they're going to take that car. I think it may just might. All right, all right. Hop in. Come on, get in. Hey! Hey! hey. You hey! You hey! This is a police emergency, all right? I need to commandeer your like, what? He hit half of it. Dude, there's no way he's gonna go screwed. That man in there, I know he doesn't look it, but he is one of the most dangerous men in the world. Oh my god, he doesn't look it, does he? You just call the station. What station? Oh, I like the sound of that gun. Hey, what station? You're doing the right thing. Oh, <laughs> Todd Father. Oh my god, this Dude, guy was being full of himself. You'd be like, what the hell happened? <laughs> but if they're building something, why here? I mean, Hawkins. Seriously. Yeah. Or a toilet stop on your way to Disneyland. But yeah, maybe that's these two of them know. Yep. Do you think the Russians know? About that. They could. They know. I don't know, but it's possible. I'm sorry, I am. you two would like to share with the class. They might have to. Wait, is that the same words I heard the first time around? It sounds like it. Yeah. It's the code. Wherever that broadcast is coming from. It's close. Oh yeah, because they're in range. And if there's one thing we know about that signal, it can reach the surface. Oh, okay, all right. We've still got our three groups, but it's all coming together. Tom? Heather? Oh, God. Yeah, we know they're all flayed at the moment. This is from that night, nothing's changed. Yeah. Haven't been back since. Yesterday. Tom had a bandage on his forehead. <sighs> yeah, okay. He got hit with it. He was attacked. Call 911! Nancy, go Nancy! My sister's gone. She kept saying, I have to go back. Mm hmm. What if the fling is taking place somewhere else? They're doing well, they're putting it together. If she wants to go back so badly, why don't we let her? Oh, I'm gonna use her as bait. I thought she said this guy was a journalist. Yeah, yeah, he was. Oh, they've gone back to this guy again. <laughs> Identify yourselves. Jim Hopper. You know. Smirnoff. Smirnoff. <laughs> He's calling him Smirnoff. A little bit eccentric, but completely harmless. <laughs> 
I don't think completely harmless. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, I knew he speak Russian. He's not eccentric, he's certifiable. Glass houses, Jess. What? You know, pot calling the kettle black. Oh, come on. Excuse me, what? Do me a favor and move your lover's quarrel elsewhere, okay? Oh! oh. oh he always gets the lovers, doesn't yeah. he? Yeah! Jonathan and Nancy! We have had a very long day. We have been shot at, nearly blown up, walked God knows how many Yeah, miles, fucking hell, when you put it that way. Stole a car, all while being chased by this gigantic psychopath, all so we could bring him to you. Because somehow, you're the closest person who speaks Russian. <laughs> Oh, Joyce is lying down low. So if you don't mind, put that thing away. Stop behaving like a jackass and ask oh, him what damn. is my magnets fall off my damn fridge. <laughs> it's all about the damn magnets. Please. She's such a mother. Yeah. <laughs> Hop's like, damn right. <laughs> all right, relax. Nobody sucks. <laughs> Oh my god, it's like full operations. Can you guys like get out of the way so you don't get seen? It looks grabby. Oh, Jesus. oh, you're just standing in the middle of the bloody hallway. We're gonna move fast, we're gonna stay low, okay? okay? I wouldn't even risk it, what are they doing? I don't know where they get this confidence from. I guess they need to get out of there somehow. And then they're locked in because it's red. Oh my god. That did not go to plan. Yeah, who are you? Kitai? She tried. She just regurgitated the words that she knew. Dude, how come Steve always gets belted? Yes, yeah, Steve, let's go! Yeah. Boom, baby! Take back what I said, <laughs> Steve, baby. Land the beat down. Dude! You did it! <laughs> Dustin! <laughs> Dustin is all of us! I can't believe, dude. Oh my god. That is perfect. That is so perfect. And it's funny with the no teeth. There's something up there. Let's see what's up there. Are they gonna see the gate? Holy shit. Yeah. Steve and Dustin have seen this before. Now Erica's involved, bloody Robin. So do they need that machine on to keep the, the gate open? Maybe it's not a maybe oh, it's not Oh, those vials are feeding this machine. Yeah. But it doesn't seem to be a permanent one just yet, like the one that L created. Yeah. They're still trying to replicate it. They are so dumb, dude. They have no idea what they're doing. Oh, um, I was just going to visit my grandma again, and and this, this is my family. <laughs> Extended. Yeah. <laughs> Two visitors at a time. Yeah. Two. This child lost her mind. She brought home. Oh zoom. God. <sighs> Alright, so the two oldies going in. This is awkward. You know. Those things that I said yesterday, I didn't mean them. I know. I don't think you're like those assholes at all. I never have. I, I was just angry. We understand each other. That's good. I was just completely, utterly, mortifyingly wrong. What? Don't let that go to your head. Oh, he was wrong about her trial. I just look forward to you never doubting me again. <laughs> My friend, you got. Hey, look, she apologized. She apologized. We'll give her that. Yeah. Oh, that's the worst. Oh. And that's the best. That's 
that's what you need, mad. So she's helping out, is what that was, you know? Dude, I think that was it. Yeah. That was what? Olive branch. <laughs> For what? Oh my god. Yeah, Mike has no idea. Okay, I'll distract Max, give you an opening, and then talk to her. Oh my this God, is not the pri priority. I oh know. Where is she? I don't know. Are you sure this is the right room? Yeah. She's gone home. Oh my God. His hands are full of blood. We were hoping it might come back. Wait, wait. Whose blood is that? Tom, whatever you've done, it's not you. He's making you do this. Oh, oh nice go hit. Jonathan. That was a nice hit, Jonathan. Oh, that guy. So they all feel it. Yeah, oh, like the hive mind, remember? Damn, they're all in this bloody hospital? Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, they're eating treats. Oh my good. god. That was good. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Will, man. Every time. Does your species like M&Ms? Your species? <laughs> I love that. I mean, it was a good way to open it up, I think. Take a piss out of it. I like the new look, by the way. It's cool. So do I. She's like, what do you have for me next? <laughs> <laughs> it's such a pudgy thing. <laughs> She's so simple and cute. Meanwhile. Oh, damn, damn. They killed everyone. Yeah. But they're just like mindless kills, it looked like. I don't think you're going to be locked in a damn room. I don't care how good oh, my God. Hang up the phone. Oh, my God. Hi there. Oh my god. What do they do now? Here for you, Nancy Drew. Yeah, of course you are. <laughs> yeah, Jonathan got humiliated. Oh shit. Oh. Oh shit. Oh my god, he's so strong. <laughs> Dude, that'll like break his freaking back. Yes, Nancy! I bet you want to do that even if he wasn't flayed. You bitch. Nancy. Yeah, what the hell? No one's hearing anything? Oh, they need L really bad. Nancy. Nancy. But why are they walking? Like, who walks? Their own personal bloody nightmare. I don't know, but the flayed guys are walking. Know, like, come know. on, man, you'll not be walking. Oh, they like taunting, don't they? Where are you going? Is he gonna get flayed? Oh, Jonathan, better not. No, no, no. <laughs> no! Oh, no. Maybe if, if he gets hurt, so will Tom. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. Thank God for that. Yes. That's what I like to see. Go to hell. Oh! Jonathan had to kill him. Oh no, tell me Billy's gonna die. No, I don't think. Hopefully not. Yeah, he's killing him so he can- and then it will come out. Damn, they really should have listened to her story earlier. Yeah, it's happening. It's happening. If these two get flayed, I'm gonna be fuming. Oh, Will is the only one. Yeah. The rest are just- All these damn couples, man. I know. Oh 
my god, it's coming out of him. It's coming out. Oh my god, run away, please. What are you what are you watching for? Oh my god. Oh, his face is thrashed, dude. Oh my god, the body's like def It's turning into the rat guts. Maybe it's their guts, but it's disgusting. Oh my god, the body's just gone and it's just that. But it's not going toward Jonathan or anything. Where's it going? Or oh, to meet up. Oh my god, is it going to be stronger together? Tell me it'll form into something. God damn it. Oh my god. Just keeps getting worse, doesn't it? Nah, nah, nah. What the fuck? It looked like Carnage. Shit, that looked like Carnage from uh, Venom's Nemesis. I do see why people make fun of your accent. I know that's not what you were expecting me to start with. What? At the end of that episode, it was nah, nah, nah. <laughs> like, even as far as Aussie standards go, dude, you took it to a whole new level. Dude, like, I immersed and that's what you came with. Well, I was immersed too and then I heard that. <laughs> and I was like, what the fuck am I listening to? So I, get, I, I heard that. I was like, oh, dude, I, I get the people and I'm Aussie. <laughs> Shut up. Other than your horrendous choice of words. That was disgusting. Wait, hang on. How are they letting them? Like, uh, maybe they're in shock, right? But I don't know. Do you, would you touch it? They don't have any equipment. What are you going to do? Use scissors and cut it up? <laughs> you got some massive slime that's about to kill you. Even even the fire extinguisher, something. Try you can't, something. That doesn't like cold. If you, use, if you use fire extinguisher, cold helps it, remember? If you had flamethrower, a different story. Mm. See? Spartan. Fudge, you ain't it. Anyway, that was cool. That it was disgusting and brutal, don't get me wrong, but that end there reminded me of Carnage. Mm. Remember his design? Like a devolved version yeah. of him. And yeah, it's interesting because we know the original body is back at the warehouse or whatever. So this is still connected to him, but it's almost formed a second smaller body. Yeah. So we've moved on from now the Demodogs and the Demogorgon. Now we're versus the Mind Flayer the, himself. The Mind Flayer, yeah, it's a whole different creature. Yeah, but it's so that's like almost like elements of his body or being, and they're all separated, and he's put them into humans. But now that that's come out, which it's like he absorbed the entire human, like he, he and it became bigger. That's what it looked like to me anyways. Because their bodies like deflated. It was nothing. It was literally just their clothes. Yeah. And then, yeah, they joined and became this massive thing. It did to the humans what it had done to the rats initially, it seems like. Yeah. Instead of popping it, just like, that was disgusting. Oh. So Tom and that guy are gone. Yeah, I was going to say, I guess there's a, there's, a va there's a job vacancy yeah, for... a couple. A couple. For uh, Nancy and Jonathan, so... Yeah. But then... Oh, it's just Billy. No, nah, I think he'll be okay. I don't know. Maybe it's a proximity thing as well. I know what you're thinking, but it wouldn't make sense to damage one. The whole army dies. Those two. No, no, I don't think they're dead now. I just, how the hell are we going to get this out of Billy without it? Like, well, the good thing is this guy's name was Tom, <laughs> but he's not a big character, but so it doesn't start it's, with it's on B, the right track. Yeah, saying. it's on the right track. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, Everything's coming together. They're all starting to realize what's going on. But we, yeah, we need to, even if they see the original body, they really need L there because I don't even yeah. know if L can stop this one. Like she could handle a fully grown Demogorgon and even that took everything from her. But she didn't even kill the Mind Flayer originally, you know, like it just yeah. it came back, it found, found a way to come back. I mean, obviously because of the Russians. Yes. So I'm left to wonder because... The Mind Flayer's essence was trapped here, then reopened. Is it a connection to its original body? I think yes. Wait, what do you mean it's trapped here? This body that's forming now is yeah. of the remnants that were left from Will that was trapped here when they closed the gateway. Right? You don't remember? Don't you remember in the warehouse 
how all the black stuff started forming again and became a shadow again. It came to life after the gate was opened. That was what yeah. left Will's body. Oh. I'm saying it was trapped in the arm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Right. But we also saw... Also, you have the small, like, thing that he forgot. Yeah. yeah. Just keep up. <laughs> we also saw that the original real big body, the giant one, was still in the upside down. I was just saying whether they'd almost formed a second version of itself, but right. no, maybe they're still connected as one being. She's being controlled... As long as the gateway is open. Yeah. Because the Mind Flayer was still in the upside down while the Demodogs or whatever were not. Yes. Oh, no, because it was in Will. Part of itself. It's sort of part of itself was yeah. sent to Will. I don't know. All I'm saying is those freaking Russians, man. Because freaking <laughs> Russians, they've not even been able to open up the gateway permanently. It doesn't look like the way they no. all did. They got them, that's why the laser needs to constantly run. To continuously maintain it, so yeah. But what uh, what do they want out of it? That's what I'm not no, no. sure of. Look, it's all we keep getting told. It's set around the Cold War period. I suppose no, it's course. about military might. They think they can extract some sort of military power. Yes, and they don't realize how in over their head they are. Yes, yeah, that's true. Holy they don't shit. know about all the U.S. experiments with it. Like the Hawkins data would be private. Well, not necessarily because like spies and they would have had, they, they would know because I think just then like, uh, Steve and Dustin were literally saying, oh, like, do you think they know they found out? They might stuff. know. Yeah. Maybe they know a bit, but I don't believe they know the, if they knew the full extent of what's at the upside down, you know, you're screwed. Yeah, but maybe they think they can control it. I don't no, know. I just don't think they've got the full Because picture. remember the Russian guy was in Hawkins lab. So was he collecting files? Like, what was he doing? Correct. That's what I'm saying. I believe they're getting some information. Yeah. I don't believe they have the full picture. Yeah. <laughs> All I'm trying to say, Budgie. <laughs> Anyways, I just like side note, I don't particularly like, you know, Lucas and Max and then Mike and Al. Like, they're, you know, in season one and two, their whole purpose was this, like, Everyone's in trouble. We yeah. need to do this. Yeah, too. The, the couples thing is really distracting everyone a lot. Yeah, it really is. And I get it. They're kids. I, I, get, I guess it is really representative of like kids just juggling a lot of shit. Yeah. So it's, it, re- it's, it's realistic. Re- it's realistic to a degree. But yeah, yeah, like Dustin and Will, yeah. they're the real ones, man. Their eyes are on the prize. Yeah. They're staying focused. Yeah. Whereas, yeah, these couples distractions, that they, they just sort it out. I mean, even Erica's cool. more involved these days. And that's saying something. Robin, I love her. Like, she is just so smart. She's, you know what's funny? Steve loves Dustin, right? And he loves the nerd. Like, they they get on. And Steve's saying, like, Robin's not his type. But Robin is, like, an older version, maybe a little bit of a cooler version of Dustin. The female Dustin, yeah. Yeah. I can't say I love Robin, but she's a cool character. I haven't fallen in love with her just yet. Yeah. But she has a nice element. I think all the characters do. Yeah. I particularly liked seeing Hop just boss up a little bit this episode. Man's been a bit of a slob this Enjoy. season. <laughs> yeah, just give me a second, Budgie. <laughs> Let me give my man Hop his due. Hop especially. Yeah. Joyce, look, she's impressed me many times and she's always pretty cool. She's pretty consistent. So that's, we didn't carry that for her. Yeah. But Hop has been, he was toned down a notch this season, not as cool, getting his ass handed to him. So it was nice to finally see my man square up. Mm. He was not blasting, things prepared to go the full rodeo and... It's just great to see him in fine form, along with my boy Steve, who finally won a fight. He won a fight. He's redeemed his name. So I do love, I do love though how Dustin called it out like we did. Yeah. I love the self-awareness this show has at times where it really as soon as you're feeling or thinking something, it just you connect, you're like, oh, it made the moment even better. Yeah, a hundred percent. So really what we have now is Hop and Joyce have Alexi and we need to remember his name. The investigator. The one trying to kill him? No, the investigator. Oh, yeah, we do need to learn his name. Yes, we will. We don't see him often enough. No. But, but yeah, the one who can speak Russian. Yeah, so they've got something there. We'll, I guess, explore that soon. Well, Robin, he'll be able to translate Alexi what the project is. Yeah, that, oh, well, if he's willing to give anything up. Yeah, I think he might be able to be convinced. Yeah, with a few slurpees or two. Yeah, but then the other guy's still on their trail, so yeah. Hop's going to need it probably... Well, at least he's got good security. Let's hope that this guy doesn't... True. You know. This is the one place for a normal home. It's actually, like, decent. Yeah. Then we've got, you know, Dustin and crew. They're in the actual, like, lab, which is bloody wild. Obviously, Robin and Eric are going to have to get filled in. And then we've got the rest of the crew 
on, I guess, this whole mind flayer tale with Mrs. Driscoll and the rest. So they're going to be on Billy's tale, essentially. Well, guys, we hope you enjoyed today's reaction. If you did, don't forget to leave a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel and let us know in the comments down below what you thought of this episode. And if you do want to get early access to our reactions or watch them in their uncut form, we'll leave a link to our Patreon in the description. Take care of yourselves and we'll see you in our next reaction. See you guys.